Thank you so much. Welcome everyone. I'm so glad you were able to join. I'm excited to talk to all of you about the CT Rise program. So I'm glad uh, that uh, you can join us to learn all about these great benefits that this program has to offer you, your family, and your friends. So let's begin. CT Rides is a free program of the Department of Transportation, and it was developed to reduce traffic and carbon emissions. We also help people save money on gas and wear and tear on their cars by finding better ways for them to get to work, school, entertainment venues, and more by taking greener modes of commuting like the bus, train, biking, walking, carpooling, and any green commute instead of driving alone. Typically, we partner with organizations and residential locations to establish their own commuter programs, but this program is available to everyone in Connecticut, so be sure to share it with all your family and friends. It can be accessed by visiting ctrides.agilemile.com or downloading the CT Rides app and I'll talk more about this as we move forward. So commuting can be challenging, as we all know. There's traffic congestion. No one wants to sit in traffic. It's awful. It could double your commute time. And by the time you get to work, you're tired or any destination, you're tired. And it's just you don't want to be stressed. It's not good for your health. And you really want to focus on what's important, like your job or your destination. The cost of commuting is a lot, especially with the gas prices rising. I'm very excited to announce that the uh, bus is free until March 31st now. So if you do take the bus, you might already know this. If you don't know this, be sure to uh, share this with all your family and friends as well. It's such a great opportunity for people who already take the bus or would like to try it. There are environmental concerns that are associated with too much traffic congestion. Our cars are emitting too much CO2 and Connecticut is just not on track to meet their goals for 2050. So we really need to work together to make the environment better by driving less alone. So 38% of all greenhouse gases come from transportation in Connecticut. So some of the transportation options that are available to you are the bus, rail, and rail, we, CT Rides, we have, C, we have Hartford Line and the Shoreline East, and there's also carpooling and van pooling. There are plenty of park and rides that you can go to if you would like to take transit or you would like to share a carpool or van pool with someone. And of course, there's always biking and walking, which is really great during the warmer months. I still see some people walking um, in the winter time, but whatever works for you, it, it's a definitely a great way to save money and reduce traffic. So this is our trip planner. And it's really great. All you have to do is download our CT Rides ride sharing app, and it will help you to find people to carpool with, but it has many other great features as well. It will show you how much money you saved on gas, the miles not driven, and the emissions you've prevented by taking a green commute. It will show you how many points you've earned when um, you record your green commutes, and it'll show you all the rewards that you can spend them on. It shows regional services like transit and bike walk services. When you join uh, using the app or on our agilemile.com website, you will get a thousand points as soon as you join. So that's a great way um, to get started. And it's the CTDOT's way of thanking you for taking a green greater commute. And there's raffles, you can go online to spend your points, and it will show you, and I'll show you as we move forward, it will show you some of the uh, local rewards that you might have in your area. 
when you're looking for someone to share a ride with, you might say, well, what if the person smokes? What if, what if they're not vaccinated? And that's important to me. Um, would you want them to wear a mask or you don't mind if they don't wear a mask? Would you rather ride with a woman or a man, whatever you prefer? Um, what language do they speak? You can choose all of that here in the trip planner and find your best match. You can find the people when you put in your starting and end point. Um, and then you can see anyone who might be going along that same route and you can click on them and start a chat with them and see if you're compatible. And you can start your um, commute with them as soon as, as you want, uh, as soon as you can. And you could also use this, you know, even if it's like one day a week, or if you want to go to the doctors and like, geez, you know, who can I rely on? Well, this is another great option. You can take a look in the trip planner and uh, see if you can find someone who can take you to your destination. And as I said, recording your trips is one of the fun aspects of this. Um, it's very, very easy. And some people might say, well, I don't want to record a trip every day. Well, you can also set uh, a trip that, say, if you take it Monday through Friday, you just call it my commute to work, and then it will record the, it automatically for you, which is kind of nice. So you don't have to, you know, if you forgot, you know, you don't want to have to have to go in there every single day to do this. So that makes it kind of nice. And here's some of those rewards, which they're great. They're mm -hmm. in your local area. You can get pizza. There might be coffee shops. There's, you know, um, entertainment places. Uh, a lot of stuff for kids, which is great. And there's the link, c2rides.agilemile.com. You might want to jot that down. Um, and the raffles are just great. Um, that if you don't want to spend your points here at restaurants or anywhere like that, you can just you could just try for the raffles. So that's kind of fun to win some money. <laughs> so every year, CT Rides, my team and I, we do a Drive Less Connecticut Challenge in May. And I just wanted to include this to show in one single month just how much of an impact we could make by sharing a ride or taking the bus or train or even teleworking. So it's pretty amazing to see that in May 2022, 16,401 car trips were eliminated, 284,982 miles were saved, and look at all the, the carbon emissions that were pre prevented, and look at all the gas that was saved, and look at all the money. That's even, that, that one hits me the most. I just am amazed that you could save so much money by even choosing a green commute, even one time a week, or even if you need, uh, it's also good in like an emergency, say you're, you get a flat tire or you know your car breaks down, it's great to have a carpool or someone you could reach out to that you can carpool with in case of an emergency, it just works out great. So definitely consider it. And since our inception, we have had, look at, look at the savings, 98,282 tons of emissions prevented. That's really great. If we could get more people to take a greener commute more often, it would really make a positive Im impact our, on our environment and even on the infrastructure. Like our roads just simply cannot handle the amount of cars and trucks on the road. So uh, we can save money on gas, as I said, and then we even, you can even track your, um, your steps and track how many calories you've burned. So there's a lot that you can do with this CT Rides app. So that is really all I have about CT Rides. I wanted to mention that we work alongside CT Transit a lot, which is the bus service here in the greater Hartford area. There's also um, Stanford CT, uh, CT Transit. And I always do events with CT Transit because they're the ones with all the bus schedules. They answer all the bus route questions that people may have. They're just a, a great resource. So if you have any questions about CT Transit, you can go to cttransit.com. And for more information about CT Rides, 
there's ctrides.com. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you learned a lot and I hope you consider downloading the CT Rides app and checking out our ctrides.com website. If you have any questions, feel free to call our customer service center. There's plenty of ways to contact them on our ctrides.com website as well. Thank you so much.